Thank you. What is that? Would you like to explain yourself, game? <laughs> hey, I'm Swarly, and this is Swarly Games, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. So this time, it's going to be very scary, but I'm not sure what is going to happen. What the scary thing is, I know it's very scary, though. Yeah, so we are in the doll house. The doll's house, not a doll house. It's a regular sized house that a doll lives in. Why it needs such a big house, I don't know. But I'm assuming it has more doll friends. Now, I made the mistake like two minutes ago of clicking on a certain video, thinking that maybe it wouldn't get spoiled for me, but I was, I was just excited to see this house. I don't know. But I heard one word, and that word was baby. God, I really wish the eyes would, like, follow you. That would be awesome. I mean, it would be terrible, but it would be awesome, if that makes sense. And let me just see if my forehead is realistic. No, it is not, unless I, unless if I have a tiny forehead. Yeah, when you move, your character, like, goes up, and then when you stop moving, he, like, settles down um, on his feet. So it's like you need to walk into something and it'll go through your face. But I, I'm not, I'm not going to sit here all day and try and get it to work. Oh, wow. Ethan has really evolved. He's not trying to tr uh, try and use that piano. I know that this is some kind of puzzle here. I know that. I heard about the doll puzzle. Oh, <gasps> uh, okay. Let me just touch her shin. We got a ring. Oh. Uh, can we not get it off, really? Oh, I was going to say the doll has arthritis or something. Blood-covered ring. Let me see if I could do something with that. Ring taken from a doll's finger. It's filthy with blood. We can examine it. Is it one of those fancy, like, Apple Watch rings that they have now? Another... A silver key. <gasps> oh, the radio... Wait, the silver key... What? They have the recording from our sonogram? <laughs> or, I guess that's not a sonogram, it's just the baby kicking. There we have three eyeballs. Oh, three closed eyeballs. Oh god, I don't want to do this. Uh, unfortunately, it works. Oh no. Hey, at least it looks nice in here. It doesn't look, you know, disgusting. Usually that means something scary is going to happen. Can you just let me close my own doors? I don't need your help, thank you very much. Oh my god, it's Dad's tackle box. It's... You need to stop stepping so much, Ethan. I'm trying to do the Louisiana double step or something. Some kind of dance. Um... Oh. Oh no. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh no, you can close it. If I wanted to play the evil within, I would have just done that. But why would I want to do that? I, I'm not here to be scared. I'm just here to play a scary game that's not scary. Oh, we can we can wash the thing. Oh, nice. We can look at this ring. We never got Mia's ring back. Maybe this is it, and I'm cheap. Is it sick part of his magna? What's in there? Okay, so that's all we can use it for. Nope, I didn't want to look at that. Wedding ring. It is a wedding ring. So if I meet someone again and, the, and it all feels right, I can go for it. Uh, oh, 052911. Nice, now we know a code. Ow, I just got a foot cramp. I better not forget 052911. Oh God, I didn't want it to work. I just want to stay here. Oh no. I'm going to have to speed up this video to 300% to make it normal speed. Oh my god. Oh! Resident Evil Village was nominated for best family game, right? A memento of my time with Ethan, but this music box no longer plays. Hey, hey, look, we know what Ethan looks like. Come on, I can't zoom in. That's not what Mia looks like, though. Predicting the future. I'm gonna meet somebody. Nice, I have a secret Why admirer. Proof of fan Ethan's everlasting love for me. You got it all wrong. I don't know what face I made at you, but I do 
get that a lot. I'm going to take a picture of it so that I do not have to remember. You know what? It's already been like 15 minutes in this video. We're sprinting the whole way. Haha, uh -huh, nothing, nothing to scare me. It's all good. It is all good. All you gotta do is be louder than the game. And then it's not scary. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna save it. Collect Rose. Why would they, why would they say it like that? That's my daughter you're talking about. You wanna be a little more gentle? These lines go together. So I'm saying those are together. I see lines. I'm trying to line them up. Because there's a crack there. It looks like that should be it. Now we play. <gasps> Tweezers. Time to go in the doll's mouth. Oh my god, but I'm making progress. I don't like making progress. I'm a very conservative person. That's not true. What's going to be in our... <gasps> ah! <sighs> you know, that... I'm not scared of that they didn't scare me with the just the sounds of a cheap jump scare it's just that i am afraid of bad decoration i do not like it when there is a crooked picture and the game won't let me fix it tweezers grab it i'm not even using my hand i'm that good oh the film her favorite toy that we need to arrange them Well, here's what I think. I think, first of all, unrelated, I just realized that I thought this, um, that the, the doll maker is dead. We saw her grave out front, and now her soul is still in the doll, that one doll. Um, that's all I know about that, but um, Umbrella, their symbol was in the thing with the houses. So I feel like Umbrella is like working with them and like made a deal with them to take my daughter and give it to them because everybody in the village is impotent. What is that? There's a person there who has horrible eyesight. You can't do this to me, Capcom. I will sue you for psychological distress. It's just Mia. Hey, Mia, I missed you. I'm gonna take a spray bottle, twist the thing, and then missed you with it. It's okay, she's gone. <sighs> God, don't mess with the door, Ethan. You have this self-opening aura around you. That was my dog yawning in the background. Okay, well, that'll be all for this video. No, I just have to hit X. Can I call my mom, tell her to drive all the way here and hit the X button for me? I need help. Maybe I could get a mannequin hand that could sit next to me that I can hold to make me feel better. Bleh. Wait, what was the picture? Okay, that's not bad. It's just the wind. There's no baby in there. That's on the video. That's not, that has nothing to do with me. Oh, God. No. What? Oh my god! Oh no, is that gonna lead to that? That I just saw in the video, what's that door? Oh my god! Stop! Stop! No! See, the dolls weren't scary before, now they're scary. For some reason. Oh god. No. Should I go back? Oh, you guys suck. Oh, oh. Where's that going to lead? Oh, no, I don't like this. At all. No, I don't like new places. I don't like change. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You monster. Do I have to answer it? What if it's just a, a spam call? What if it's a telemarketer? Oh, my God. No, I don't want your product. I'm not going to listen to anything she's about? saying. It's I not lore friendly. So much. I had to. What? I had to do it. Is it is it anything? Is that real? Don't look to your left. Okay. <laughs> oh, nice. It's just uh we need a piece of a baby. We need a baby to put there. 
but we need one with a giant head. Or I guess we we're not getting Rose. It's not it's not a representation of Rose because it doesn't it doesn't have a giant head. Oh, tomato. Oh, moo. Bruh. Okay. Don't don't I can get it myself. I'm not there yet. You're holding the door for me, but I'm way too far back. Now it's awkward. Okay. Ah! Oh. Market NSFW. Oh, okay, it's fine. Oh my god, brass media. We're just gonna put the thing in there and it's all good. We it's fine, it's fine. There's nothing to worry about. Oh god. Oh my. Do we even want this girl? You can make another. We can find somebody else, somebody who isn't a monster, or wasn't. I can't make commentary, they're trying to ruin my video. That's more scary than anything. Oh no. Okay, at least we're in water. Nothing can hurt me when I'm in water. No! Should I just run for it? God, that's creepy. I know. They're sending everything after me. They're sending everything after me. I have the ticket. Yeah. Uh, you just lost half of your earbud privileges. Can I see the door? It's this way. Shut up, baby. When I open this door, my life will change forever. And by that, I mean it'll end from a heart attack. Oh my god, I don't like this. I don't like Hey, keep whining, baby. Come on, you gotta keep screaming. There is nothing comforting here. Nothing to stop you from being annoying. You can hide in the lockers. I do not want to have to use them. Hopefully it was like they planned to do a hiding sequence, but then they cut it out and they just forgot to remove the lockers. That's what it was. Stop it. Mm-mm, I don't like suspense. That's why I always wear a belt. Maybe the game expected everybody to try and Outsmart the system and go the other way? What is that? Would you like to explain yourself, game? <gasps> Excuse me, Ethan? Ethan, I paused your voice. You are trying to intrude on my pausing privileges. Bah! I can see it. Oh man, that, that sounds like a baby. I don't like it, it's almost as scary as my real life baby. Game, do not. Do not, do not. Don't. Ah, there's a joke about contractions and babies. But I cannot make it, because I am too scared. Breaker box, key. There is no baby, I just despawned it. You have to be joking. I am relieved of a child. I can go home. Child relief, nice. Not gonna happen, game. They're profiting off of my fear of babies and the only thing holding me back and keeping me mentally stable is the fact that it looks like a giant monster, which I love giant monsters. I'm not afraid of those. It's the babies that really scare me. Oh, oh man, game. Why? There's an umbilical cord? Oh my god. Does that show where it's been? It drags that around. I'm gonna I'm gonna take an earbud, put it on my shoulder, so I can hear. Yeah, order the ficuses. I don't know, something somebody with this with their phone on their shoulder would say. Babies do not exist. Babies are a myth. Babies don't exist. No, no. Oh my God, that's gonna turn off power. Why are, why are all of your pillows that material? It looks not very comfortable. Bah. Run. Oh my God, it's huge. You're not gonna get me, baby. Oh my god, I do not like this, but I know where the baby is. I know where the baby is. Spam it. Oh my god! Oh, oh! 
Oh, baby, stop. I'd have trouble sleeping at night being a designer for Capcom. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh my god, that was one of the scariest... Probably the scariest sequence I've ever done in a game. Can you stop laughing? There is nothing that funny. Maybe she's watching one of my videos, but that's... That's unrealistic. Don't leave. I can't let you. Hey, that's fine. That's fine. You're still alive. So that's the doll maker. Oh god. Can you stop? Give me my weapons back. Make it fair. Oh god. I have to do something. Wait, what? Try and find me. Oh my god. What? I didn't see that door. There she is. What? So I couldn't see the door because it was too dark. I agree. She's got a monster head. She has blood. There. Yeah. Oh man. Uh oh. Now where is she? <laughs> yes, I frequently stab her in the head. Although that doesn't work for humans. I mean, we die. So I guess it does work if that's your intention. There. Yes. Oh, man, she's got strings coming out of her head. <laughs> well, that was strange. I was wondering how they were going to make a tiny doll creepy. What? I mean, I mean, she's already creepy. I mean, like, scary, like Resident Evil scary. And we have a giant key. Make things right. Why would they make it so that if I die... I want to make sure that this comes up from the floor because the person who kills me is probably going to want this and I want to reward them. Legs, we got the legs. That was scary. The doll part wasn't that scary, but man, that baby. It seems kind of disconnected. Like it was scary, but it's like it didn't really have much to do with the actual person. But I'm sure there's lore around it that I just don't know. I love how they structured these, like where you know you're, what you're going into, like you know who you're fighting but you don't know what they're gonna do for that person. So it's like you're actually looking forward to something because you have an idea of what it's gonna be. Okay, I'm gonna end it right there. This video, well, uh, there wasn't much commentary, but it was extremely scary. We finished Beneviento's section. That was awesome and terrible at the same time. So make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed. I'll see you in a few seconds when you click on the next video. So good night and good luck.